Hello everybody, my name is Devlin Irwin. Welcome to a tutorial over Adobe Premiere Pro. Recently I've had to make a player intro videos for my high school and th this is for the girls varsity team and I have a girl here and I'm going to be showing you how I made mine. First you want to file and import the clip you want and after you do that you can adjust it to however long you want you would like it to be the next thing I did was I added a title and to do that you can come up here to title and new title and here are the different things you can do to it you can have their name what grade they're in their height whatever you want it doesn't have to be for basketball either and you also want to choose I'm assuming if you're doing this you want to choose a background and for this I just did a basketball court and you can see the key in the three-point line after that you want to put your clip in the video 2 your title with your words in video 3 and your background in video 1 adjust it to length and then you can click on your clip come over to the effects tab and type in ultra key and it should appear here and if you click on that I've already clicked on it so I'll just show you what comes up if you click on that and come up to effect controls you will see this little drop down menu and in yours if you have any wrinkles or anything in the green screen you might have some dark black areas like this shadow here and it might look a little bit like this with dark creases and the easiest way I found to make it look a little better you can't fix all of it because it's not perfect but the easiest way I found is to come and instead of default in your setting click aggressive and it seems to clean it up pretty nicely the next thing you want to do is set this picture as where the green screen was and to do that you want to click on this little paintbrush here this little eye drop tool I'm going to click on that and click on the color of this the color of the green and the, the picture should cover all of the green even under parts like this so you shouldn't be able to see any green if you did it correctly the next thing you want to do to make it look a little more professional is come back down to effects and type in crop and click on this and drag it into clip with ultra key you might want to drag it into clip and it might work a little better too and when you drag that in you get another drop down like this and the same effect controls under ultra key and with this you can get rid of like if I brought this back down to zero you can crop it so instead of like here's my that's my tech this is my tech box but here's my video and you can see that I shifted it over so she's not directly in the center but if you want you can get rid of a few of these lines too by if you just take this and then you can just come over to the left because it's on the left side you can just drag it because you see these arrows you drag it and then you see that the line is gone but if you drag it too far you might be cutting off whatever you want to be seeing so that's a, another cool way to fix it up and with mine I shifted the girl over so that when she does her little routine I'll show you here that when her routine is going I can have her text appear on the left so that you can clearly see her in her little routine more than if she was in the middle having her face cut off or her the ball or her arm by the letters 
So yeah, thanks guys for watching and I hope you learned something. Come back for the next tutorial. Thank you.